hi welcome now i'm going to show you how to change uh, the boolean values true or false into zero and ones okay so why we make it uh, zero and one because uh, in formulas you want to use uh, true or false then it will become uh, the uh, the value of true or false needed to be or changed into zero and one okay we cannot straight away use uh, true or false because it's the condition the value of the condition whether the condition is true or false okay since it's boolean values and uh, these values are uh, true or false but uh, we want it to be zero or one in our formula so that uh to write to complex formulas or conditional formulas it will be more useful okay so how we are going to change uh, the true or false into zero and one that is our objective and uh, what i have here is the uh, the sheet uh, products uh, each item what is the supplier one's price quote and uh, supplier two's price quote okay so each item what is the uh, quotation from the supplier one and the supplier two the prices two different prices given by two different suppliers for the same product item one okay similarly for i have uh, about uh, 14 items and uh, uh, 14 items so now what i am going to do is i first to bring the true or false first okay for that i use the um, condition whether uh, supply one's price is greater or greater uh, supply one's price is greater than uh, supply two price that is my condition okay for that we usually write in uh, uh, in uh, if condition but uh, now what I'm going to do is I'm writing it using a uh, conditional operators so equal to is as usual for any formula I just we used to put uh, equal to sign to start up with the uh, formulas and uh, let the ex Excel know that uh, a I'm going to write a formula whatever um, after equal to sign is a formula but uh, here it is the condition okay so uh, what is our uh, formula now s1 is greater than s2 uh, s1 is s2 is nothing but uh, this cell b2 is greater than c2 okay we usually use if b2 is greater than c2 then true else false okay for the whole statement now it is with uh, just uh, using a simple uh, uh, simple conditional operator this helps us to simplify lot of uh, uh, lot of uh, uh, formulas or expressions and also uh, instead of using a if uh, and then go to the next step to use the uh, true or false straight away it gives uh, in the formula itself we can use the conditional operators and do the formula okay uh, false true or false similarly false so s1 is uh, not greater than 2 so it is false so is any condition uh, where the uh, this condition s1 is greater than s2 yes okay this way you can get the um, true or false here okay what we did was uh, we just to put a condition here we didn't put a if condition to uh, get the uh, then part or else part we just put a condition it gives whether it is true or false okay so our objective now is that uh, how to um, change this true or false into un uh, into zero or ones i need a false to be zero and uh, true to be one okay so the true value must be one and a false value is zero how to do that okay for that uh, we we have the unary operator okay this operator is uh, we all know that it's simply a minus sign okay what what is the help of minus sign minus sign always put and uh, uh, make uh, values uh, negativity of uh, that positive value if it is negative then it will change it to positive okay so i will show you how to 
when it comes to numbers it makes it makes negative or positive negative and negative and negative of negative is positive but uh, yeah, when it comes to uh, boolean values it is um, boolean values in terms of true or false uh, what it makes is it also changes the true or false into numbers okay so uh, false what i am doing is equal to again is a formula unary operator then uh, the true or false cell okay d2 and uh, see now what happened was uh, the unary operator when you make uh, uh, make a condition or make the expression on uh, the true or false using a unary then automatically it changes that value to zero and ones okay false is zero okay what happens when it comes to true minus one not just one two values one so it makes minus so it comes with the minus one okay now we have the problem is that uh, false is okay because if you introduce uh, a unary operator on false it becomes zero so false is okay but uh, what happens to true it is minus one so when you want to make uh, this minus one to one again you may you again you apply the unary on that minus one okay then you will get a, uh, plus one so it has to be two times uh, uh, double unary on true or false okay zero just fine so double unary gives the uh, condition to zero and ones okay so the double unary is the thing that makes uh, uh, to make uh, true or false values into zero and one so when you see the uh, in a formula uh, double unary minus minus then you should not be panic that what is this minus minus okay it's nothing but it simply changes the uh, true or false set into zero and one so that's it okay so just make sure um, in your uh, make clear that whenever you see a double unary then bracket something that means it changes that value the condition into zero and ones or if it is a set is coming the whole set is changed into zero and one if this d2 is nothing but a array then the minus uh, minus will change the whole array into zero and ones okay uh, why this is uh, so important to have a video here because uh, mo lo a lot of time when you use formulas uh, some are products we need the condition to be true or false uh, into zero and one so that we can use it the condition uh, on the formula we uh, we always use minus minus that time the uh, most of them it it looks the f uh, it looks uh, or it seems the formula is very complicated it is not so when you keep this one in mind then it will be very easy for you to write uh, your own formulas and also understand uh, those formulas written by others okay so hope this video is helpful to you and uh, uh, if you have any comments or suggestions you just leave it on the comment session and also uh, give a like to this video if you like it and also subscribe to my channel so that you will find a lot of useful excel videos uh, uh, from the elementary level to advanced level okay and uh, at least you will find one video on uh, any topic okay so uh, have a good day and uh, god bless you